Hey guys, how's it going? It's Faultech Armor, and today we're going to be discussing a pretty controversial topic in my opinion, is Call of Duty Dead. Now I'm not going to be talking about a certain game in this video, that will be for later videos through this mini-series, but today we're just going to be really discussing is Call of Duty as a franchise, or Activision, you know, are they headed down a bad path, or are they just getting started? So before we really get into this video, I just want to take a second to thank Swarm for letting me use his gameplay. His link will be in the description below. He actually just started out on YouTube, so if you guys want to go over there and support him, then we will both really appreciate it. So first guys, we need to go back to 2013, the fall of 2013, when Call of Duty Ghost was made. Oh gosh, this game guys. I, I don't know if you feel the same way, but this game really triggers me. Honestly, this game was poorly executed in my opinion and a lot of other people's opinions as well. And it really just, it really just put a damper on the Call of Duty franchise. You know, it the, the morale was at an all-time low, and at, up until Black Ops Three came out, the sales were down about fifty percent on both Call of Duty Ghost and Advanced Warfare. Now, with both of those two games coming out, it kind of created what I like to call a snowball effect for the Call of Duty franchise. I think that if it weren't for Black Ops 3, it would have continued to be like this. And the only reason why it wasn't like this whenever Black Ops 3 came out was because it was just Black Ops 1 and Black Ops 2 were just so well received. But honestly, guys, when now the Infinite Warfare has come out, you know, I, I didn't play too much of it, but I did play the beta. You know, it, it, it is okay. It's not as bad as those two games that I mentioned earlier, Advanced Warfare and Ghost, but honestly, I feel like they kind of copied Black Ops 3 quite a bit, you know, as far as the jetpack system and everything. They really did just kind of copy it, in my opinion, and I, I just don't really like the way they did that. I think they should have been a bit more unique with it. And you know, one other thing that is really kind of helping support the idea that Call of Duty is kind of dying is that Treyarch has pretty much announced, they haven't officially announced it I don't think, but they've pretty much announced that they are stopping the zombies storyline. So I don't know if that means they're never going to make another zombies game or game mode, but that that spark is going to be gone and I don't think it'll ever be able to be the same. One really good idea I have that I think Treyarch should do, if they're allowed to, is you know, about halfway through the life cycle of Infinite Warfare, I think that Treyarch should make a sort of DLC 5 or just, you know, just crazy cool update or something. Just something to kind of get the community through because I know a lot of people are going to go back to Black Ops 3 after they see how Infinite Warfare is. And I'm not, I'm not hating on Infinite Warfare. I'm not saying it's that bad of a game, but in my opinion, I think that Infinite Warfare is not as good as Black Ops 3. So I think that they should make some type of DLC 5 or something to kind of keep the community going and you know they might need to sign a contract with the current company that has a game out the most recent game but either way I think that would be a really good way to kind of save Call of Duty and kind of keep the game going keep the franchise going I also wanted to give a huge thanks to all the people that have subscribed to our channel you know we just hit a huge milestone of 2,000 subscribers and we couldn't have done that without your help so that brings us to the end of the video. If you enjoyed it, leave a like and subscribe for more content like this and much more gameplays. Also, if you want to leave any input on how we can make our videos better for you guys to watch, let us know in the comments. And until next time, this has been Voltec Armor. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.